What's up YouTube? It's your boy Finesse Face coming at you with another video and today we got this clean high type of transformation as you can see with the waves on my boy John John and we just gonna get right into it. Now first step is to make a ball guideline on both sides of the temple and in the back so we can have nice even fades. And I'm using the Oster Octanes to pretty much remove all the bulk and get it balled as quickly as possible. Next thing I do is I switch my blade using the same clipper with the one and a half taking the hair down to his desired wavelength. On this step, I'm taking a two guard to pretty much debulk the side so I can go ahead and start my fade. Pretty much after debulking this area, I won't really need to use too many more guards. So from this point, I'm just going to be using my open blade and then my one guard to pretty much blend out the rest of this taper. You can see as well as I constantly cut, I'm combing the hair down to put it back in place so I can get a good visual of what the fade is already looking like as I go. And what you saw me do just then, I was basically laying the hair down and debunking it at the same time so I can make sure that the fade is smooth. The more I go into the fade, you can see me change my angles, change the stroke whether I'm going with the grain, against the grain, and it's all just to pretty much help me blend out the taper how I need it to be. And right here, I'm using another debulking method, which would be considered a claw method, which basically helps debulk and lays the hair down as well. Man, this is fire. And as you can see, I'm changing the angle and using the corner of the blade so I can control how much hair I'm cutting off. I missed out on doing majority of the back taper, but the same principle applies. I do the same steps, debulk with the two, and then use just the one and the open blade to blend out the rest of the taper. In the neck area, his hair is not as dense as it is all over the other side of the head, so it doesn't take too much work to blend it out. Like I was doing on the first side of the head, I was using the claw method and flipping the clipper back over again to use the corner to control how much hair I'm taking off. Man, 
this is fire. Shout out to my boy Rock Man and Right Hand. They killed this beat. They always kill it. I keep on telling. Keep pushing, fellas. Keep doing what you do. And now for the lineup, I'm using my trimmer as a pencil, just using the edges, tracing that line over the ear. I'm using my index finger on top of the ear as a brace to help me have balance. And as you can see, you can see it a lot better on this side. I'm using that trimmer like a pencil to pretty much frame my lineup and I'm keeping it as natural as possible and line it up out as wide as possible. I'm doing this line this way so I can pretty much keep it right above that eyebrow and I won't push back into that line. Whenever I start someone's line, I usually start in the middle and go to the side which is highest, but for him, all I have to do is just keep his line up as natural as possible. And right here, we're going to go with a little bit of color enhancement. I mixed it myself with the black and brown and a little bit of alcohol. As you can see, I also used a pencil. I didn't show that part, but I will show you how to get it out effectively. And with the color enhancement, you don't want to spray it too much. You kind of want to tap spray to pretty much control how much you put on there. You want it to look as natural as possible. As you can see, I got it exactly how I want it. Fairly dark, but not too dark, so it can look just as natural as it can be. And I always double down the hair color with some fibers to make sure that the spray doesn't look wet and it looks as natural as possible. Throw some spritz on the hairline to lock it in and just watch the details for the rest of the cut. And as you watch me finish the rest of this cut, I need you guys to do me a favor. Like, share, comment, subscribe, whatever you got to do. I'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers and I need you guys' help. So help your boy out, please. Come on, man. Also, follow your boy on all social media platforms at Finesse Fades. And don't forget to visit my website at finessephase.com. We got a lot in store for you guys. This is fun.